clicking on the feedback tab above, you'll be navigated into your feedback manager page. The feedback manager stores all of your seller feedback and you're able to search by date range, order ID, keywords, or buyer email. You can customize the date range that is displayed or select an exact date. You have the following filters available for FBA or FBM orders or the star rating provided. If you scroll below, you'll be able to see your seller feedback that is provided. So for this seller feedback, this is demi data. So for your actual seller feedback, it will be displayed right here and it will let you know what type of order it was, the product that was purchased, when the feedback was received, the star rating provided, the status, order ID it came from, and the purchase date. You can always see the order status as well that this one is shipped and if you wanted to edit you can see this pop-up up here for custom labels or feedback notes. The custom labels help you filter a lot easier for this feedback so if you did want to create any labels there's videos going over how to set those up. Any notes that you do leave, this is internal, so it is for your own reference and it does help you stay organized. Let's say this feedback is going to have a return or anything coming soon, you can always save a note for yourself to reference, so you can search by notes. You click on this drop down, you'll be able to also contact the customer if you needed to manually send them any email. And you can always manage this feedback inside Seller Central. And that's how to use the Feedback Manager within FeedbackWiz. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and for more information, please visit FeedbackWiz.com.